Yo, got a little something new and a touch of the old school boost for the ladies and Jordan for the grade school. Kanye on the roster, a little bit of fly, and an updated classic. I think you're gonna feel it. So without further ado, let's drop news and make it easier for your squad to cop shoes. That's like five bars. <laughs> Welcome to the Heat Check. I am your host, Jacques Slade. And this week, well, it kicks off with some shoes that are pretty much sold out at this point. The Nike Air More Up Tempo collaboration with Supreme dropped today in red, black, and gold. Oh my gosh, that gold looks so dope. Um, and as you know, most items that come from Supreme, well, they sell out pretty quickly and these are pretty much sold out already as well. But there is a rumor that they will be restocking at a later date, so you can hold on to that if you missed out. Those are gonna cost you $190. On the new side from Nike, we have the Nike Air Vapor Max. The look of this shoe has been a hot topic since they first released uh, during Air Max month. I'm personally a big fan of the look. Um, this colorway is officially being called Asphalt and it'll cost you $190 for those oversized airbags. And you can grab those right now over at Finish Line. Not that I haven't been telling you guys this for a few months now, but Puma is killing it. They just released some numbers about their brand and their revenue and their profits are way up. And I think a lot of it has to do with this collaboration with Rihanna. They're doing the Puma Fierce and the Puma Basket. And right now, Finish Line has both pairs for $100 and you can grab either one. Sticking with the ladies, Adidas is dropping the NMD XR1 in two colorways just for them. These feature that updated design on the upper and it looks like they're actually primed it as well, which should make these extra comfortable. There's two colorways dropping. There's the Utility Ivy and then there's a the Clear Granite and both of those look really nice. Those will cost you 150. If Fly Knit is more of your thing, then you should probably check out the Converse Chuck Taylor All-Star High. These are dropping in, I believe, six colorways this weekend and the color that really stands out to me, to be honest, is that red. It's super bright, but I think there's just something with the way that red fly knit looks that I really like. There's also green glow, which looks very nice as well. Again, there are five, maybe six colorways of these dropping this weekend and they'll cost you $110. Another fly knit shoe that is dropping this weekend is the Sock Racer Ultra Fly Knit. Just looking at these, you can see how comfortable they are. Nike has, I believe, five of these getting ready to drop as well. And those are gonna cost you $160 for both men and women. If basketball is more of your thing, then Nike Sportswear is bringing back the Nike Air Shake Indestruct. This is one of the most unique old school basketball shoes from Nike but they were worn by one of the most unique basketball players I've probably seen in my lifetime. Those will cost you 140, and you can grab that red and white colorway actually over at Finish Line starting tomorrow. Moving ahead to Saturday, we have some of the most anticipated drops of the week. First up, let's start with Jordan Brand as they actually have three different shoes that are dropping this weekend. First up is the Air Jordan Retro 7 in the grade school size. This one uses black and hyper pink on the upper, making it a bit flashy for school, which I think is pretty cool. Those are gonna cost you $140 in that grade school size and they actually all the way, go all the way down to toddlers. For those that wear normal Jordan sizes, well, Jordan Brand hasn't forgot about you as they have the Air Jordan 7 Pantone dropping. Most people are probably gonna call this University Blue because that's the actual name of the color and that university blue looks great with that white but if you look on the liner they have a little pop with that black accent i really like that as well uh those are going to cost you 190 dollars and you can pick those up on saturday now also coming from jordan brand is the air jordan 31 why not beautiful beautiful shoe this is russell westbrook's player exclusive version of the shoe but jordan brand is nice enough to release it to the public and let us try and get our hands on it from what i understand these are going to be pretty limited and they'll cost you 200 dollars and probably the biggest release of the weekend and the hardest one for us to get our hands on is going to be the Adidas Yeezy 350 V2. As you guys already know, the number on the numbers on these are super limited and they're going to be quite difficult to grab. The official colorway is cream white and these look like they're the perfect shoe for summer. Expect, uh, expect those to cost you $220 when they arrive at finish line on Saturday. As with every week, guys, there may be a few other things dropping, but I just wanted to give you guys the quick highlights of the stuff that I thought you would definitely be paying attention to. As always, I am Jacques Slade. This is the Heat Check presented by Finish Line, and I appreciate you. Make sure you turn on your notifications for this channel, and I'll see you soon. Peace.